I think I'm ready to have the conversation that Don Tolliver is a better feature artist than he is an album artist. Don Tolliver just dropped his newest album, Hearthstone Psycho. Let's talk about it. Now, don't get this twisted and think that this is me saying Don Tolliver is not capable of making great solo music because he has in the past and he does on this new album as well. But the best tracks on this album are the ones that feature him the least. Attitude with Charlie Wilson and Cash Cobain. Ice Age with Travis Scott. The best song on the album, in my opinion, Purple Rain with Future and Metro Boomin. Which, by the way, is this the first time we've ever heard this new Metro tag before? Metro and his bitch on brain. Even on Backstreets, where Don Tolliver is the primary artist and Tizo just contributes background vocals, the whole time you're kind of just waiting and hoping that Tizo has a verse. For me, really the only really good solo Don Tolliver songs on the album that I'm going to have in my rotation are Kryptonite, Bandit, of course, one of the better songs of the year. And I thought Last Laugh was pretty good too. Now just some rapid fire random thoughts that I had listening to the album for the first time. The first half is stronger than the second half. The production is pretty great. The vocals actually are really good too. And it feels like Don Tolliver put a lot more effort into polishing Hearthstone Psycho than he did his last album, Love Sick. Overall, it's just a little bit disappointing for me though. I'm hoping that the album will grow on me, but it just feels a little bit lackluster. But as always, I've added my favorite tracks off of the album to my new Music Friday playlist, which you can find the link to my Spotify in my bio. I update this playlist every single week with my favorite releases. That way you don't miss any of the good stuff. Please let me know below in the comments, what did you think of Don Tolliver's newest album, Hardstone Psycho? And don't forget to follow me, Honeybee Reviews, for more music-related content.